Hey guys, I'm 320 and welcome back to Subnautica. So, in this episode we are finally leading straight to the primary containment facility, where we are about to unleash all secrets that are hidden there, because apparently all viruses and big deadly creatures were unleashed, so uh, the only thing that's left for us and secrets and great amazing sea emperor the Vyphon. Uh huh, wait. My succubus is damaged, yeah? Oh yeah, I've got one, two, three, four holes. Should I try to get out and repair it? Oh, these creatures are just fascinating. So, yeah. Stop distracting, let's get the fuck out of uh, Cyclops and I'll try to deal with these holes. Because the way back to my hold babe will be really dangerous. So, is it my repair tool? Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. So guys, ignore me. Ignore this big metal thing floating here and small delicious meat lingering around this I don't know sausage <laughs> metal sausage what I'm speaking about oh fuck you scary buster so I think that's the last call that left to repair and I'm done with my job and now finally I can carry on with my life uh -huh, I know, I know, I need oxygen, I'm a human, blah blah blah. So, I'm not sure that I know the way where I have to go right now. Because I've never been in this location before, but I'm so happy that I've got this beacon there. Hot babe beacon. So, I can try to orient on it somehow? And that's it, I don't know. We will see, I think maybe I'll cut till I get to some magnificent point in my life and... Yeah. Oh shit, look at this map and the amount of creatures. That floating there. That's a lot. Seriously, it would be a really stupid idea to build base here. But come on, the view is so good. Just so freaking good. And our energy is doing pretty great. And by the way, thank you, Barbara, for my sweat or peace. I still don't know what is this in these pockets, bags that you provide me with. Ah, I just really hope it's pure clean water, and that's it. Hmm. Okay, so we already have got some drop down cave. She shit, but I have to be really careful. What is this? Uh I forgot that's the name of this material, but as far as I remember, I don't freaking need it at all. Oh yeah, and I just remember that I forgot to collect uh, mushrooms? Not mushrooms, fuck, what's wrong with me? Why I always forget today? Yeah, right here. Yeah, I forgot to collect table coral sample and maybe common coral sample a bit too. And something else, something else really important. Oh yeah, this stuff. Rotten creepvine sample. I just need simple creepvine sample. Why the rotten? Ah, still, I can use them. But I've got just three of them and I'm not sure that that will be enough because, again, I don't remember if I have to use it somewhere for building base. Ah, but I'll try to relax about that. It's, I guess it would be it's not so hard to return all the way back and collect a couple of samples. Alrighty then, where am I right now? There is some kind of skeleton. Hmm, is this sea dragon leviathan? Have I ever been here in this location? Because I remember one sea dragon leviathan already. And I scanned this body. Okay, let's check it out. Maybe, just maybe I'm following the right direction. So, are you sea dragon, yeah? Yeah, and I can scan you. Okay. Just chill here, bro. Ah. Oh, wait a minute. That tree, it's already here. Fuck, that's great. So that was really short way to get to this tree. Because before I was entering from the another part of the Subnautica map, it, it took me a huge amount of time to get to this point. Now it's much easier. Cool. I'm glad that uh, I decided to spend my time and find a new coordinates for a second entrance to the Lost River. Hi, giant cove tree. Have they implemented some kind of updates about this tree? Because it looks for me like this egg look a bit different. Oh, no, 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 it's the same. It just wasn't loaded properly. Okay, then. Ah, shit, the view in this cave is so fascinating, so cool. Just look at this tree. Yeah, I know, I spent already in some of uh, Subnautica episode about maybe 10 minutes observing this tree and trying to make some kind of cool screenshot. Hey! Ghost Rave, get the fuck out! Don't be stuck in my Cyclops. Shush! Skidal! 
No, 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 you're not going with me. No, actually, it would be really fun to grab you with me to an active lava biome. Or oh, active lava biome. By the way, I'm curious, what would happen if uh, Sea Dragon Leviathan and, uh, and Ripple Leviathan will meet each other? Hey, what are you doing there? <laughs> Seriously, these creatures are so baggy. But I still love them. So, will Sea Dragon attack Ripple Leviathan? Will they fight with each other? Maybe when I'm done with this game, I'll try to double around a lot with uh, cheats and console, and maybe I'll try to spam Sea Dragon and uh, Ripple Leviathan and just observe them fighting with each other. <laughs> they see me rolling. They hating. <laughs> oh, fuck. This ghost ray. Hi, Warper. So I guess we're already in inactive lava biome. Is it true? What? Biome ILZ Corridor? Very, really strange name for the biome, but that will do. So I'll go back to the silent mod. Because here I have to be really careful. Oh shit, not you! You piece of fuck! Seriously, are they going to annoy me again? Well, though, sucker. Where he did his suck to my cycles? I don't know, I just want to check. What would happen if I unplug all power cells? Like, do you remember this kind of experiment that I was speaking about in the previous episode? And where did I get this call already? Seriously, where? I didn't hit anything, nobody was attacking me. Alright, one guy is right on HA letters. So I'll try to unplug all my power cells and see if these guys will unsuck. And just leave me alone. So let's grab all power cells, and I know that there will be no oxygen if I do like that. But that's okay. So that will do. There should be zero power. No, 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 you have nothing to suck here. Absolutely nothing. Just Kidal. Huh, actually there are a lot of them, but I guess, yeah, it works. That's cool, really cool. So I can get rid of all these uh, guys just un by unplugging power cells. Great knowledge. Yeah, yeah, no, and I don't have oxygen here, so I have to hurry up with plugging these power cells back. At least one of them. And the strongest one, iron power. That will do. But I guess all these suckers will uh, attach to my cyclops right now, back. But I'll try to hurry up to get out of this zone a bit further. Shit, where am I? It's really dark here, I barely can see something. Huh, seriously, I'm really curious, how does this whole cave look if you switch on the light everywhere? Is there some kind of cheat codes that can allow you to, I don't know, push brightness of the game really, really up? Or maybe just create small sun right here. Actually, I can do that, I can just create a foundation for the base and put some kind of a light, flashlights. No, 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 you don't want, you don't want that. Shish, go away. I just killed a couple of your friends. Oh, poor thing. Okay, they stuck to me. Can I see them from this camera? Not really. Okay, Skiri, what about upper camera? Can I see these guys? Huh, not really, so where are they? Maybe they just gave up. They understand that right now I know some trick how to get rid of them and like, ah, eh, it's not so interesting anymore. So screw this free to all guy. And high warper number, I don't know, 4 5 already that I noticed in this cave. You're really active recently, and there are a lot of you recently everywhere. Hmm, so I think I finally reached Lava Castle, if I'm not mistaken, at least here, it looks like Lava Castle. And the entrance to the active lava biome should be somewhere nearby, maybe right after it. Oh, hello, bro. Are you securing the entrance? Shit, I think he does right now. I should be really careful with him. So will he try to attack me while I am in silent mode? That's really important question because bro, no, don't attack me, please. Stay there, just let me be. Really soon we'll be neighbors. And we'll have fun, I don't know, we'll play with each other, football, make a barbecue, you can, I don't know, shoot with fire from your mouth and that's fucking amazing, you can help me with barbecue a lot. But drop down way should be right here, I guess. Is it right, Warper? Maybe. Or maybe not. Wait, where is my camera again? Uh, no, not here. Actually, maybe it is. 
Oh yeah, bingo. That's the way down. By the way, I have no idea what's farther in this biome, on this level of cave. Because I've never tried to discover everything, everything around. I mean, come on, it's a bit complicated. We see Dragon Leviathan patrolling around and it's dark and scary. So now, what way? Oh, right here. Okay, okay, Cyclops, don't be stuck. Let's move a bit to the front. And oh yeah, we're really finally close to the primary containment facility. And to my hot bay base. Hot bay base. That sounds really great. Uh, and here we go, my home sweet home, that don't, that doesn't really want to load itself apparently. Oh shit, where is the dragon, the second one? I don't really see him and that scares me a bit, but that's my hot babe. <sighs> my really small poor base. But it looks really amazing, this lull that's just piercing my base. Okay, Barbara, I don't give a shit about that right now. What did I do? What the fuck did I do? I think I switched on the light. Fuck, no, no, no. I don't want to do that. Mm -hmm. That's the exact thing that, that I want to do. I want to be sneaking in here. And just don't disturb the nature around me. So, hot babe, I'll check a thing in this episode called Primary Containment Facility. And the next episode I'll try to... Not I'll try, I'll build. Really great and amazing base in Subnautica. Alright, let's try gently park my Cyclops right here. So, I still don't know if I can enter this base. I think no. I don't see any keyhole where I can plug my key stuff. Wait, why I'm not in the silent mode? Or oh, I am. Oh, maybe it's just this... Uh, uh, light, green light from the base. So, what do I need? Ah, I think nothing. I'll just go straight there. I don't have water... Oh yeah, I'm starving a bit, but yeah, that's not really important for now. And I think it's time to save my game, because it was a really long way. It took me about maybe half an hour uh, to get from the upper point to the lower point. So, hi, hi, hi. Why I'm still hot? I'm wearing reinforced dive suit, by the way. What the fuck this sound? Hi, Warpa. What are you doing, no? You can touch me here. You can go here. You can. Oh shit, he can. What the? Go away. Shush. <laughs> That's not fair. Fuck. Seriously, what's wrong with you? <laughs> what he doing there? I think he's pushing my Cyclops a bit. What the? Okay, I'll eat a bit, first of all. And then maybe I'll try to go there with my prawn suit, but my prawn suit will not help me against Warper. Welcome aboard, Captain. Mm hmm thank you. Boris! Where's your fucking upgrades? Fuck! No, 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 don't do that with me. I swear, I plugged all upgrades inside you already. Yeah, brush compensator. Return it back, faster. Is it better right now? I hope so. So where is the warper? Okay, I think it ran away. Good for me. So how can I unlock this door? I remember that there is some code that I can use in console. And wait a minute, I'll try to look it up. The knife remains the only exception. Sorry about that. Mm -hmm. So Barbara finished, so hey, free to all from the future. Ah, apparently I found out that in my uh, official save game I can't. I don't have any updates connected with prison. I don't know how does it work. Because uh, right now I've just started a new game and I teleported myself straight to the prison. And I've got the same version of the game, 4A202. And here I already see the difference. I unlock the door and I see that there is something after this door. Huh, so I really pumped to discover what's there, but I think I'll switch on my survival mode back, because maybe it will be more interested. So, let's see what's there. I'll discover the whole prison room and uh, prison building, and I think after that I'll turn back to my normal save game, and maybe I'll just wait till official update, till developer developers finally 
implemented all updates connected with this prison and for fuck's sake what is this shit there are a lot of stuff I thought there will be something like big aquarium and that's it I didn't expect any data any this thing what is this alien relic okay good for you and let's see uh, despite a simple design, this device contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet and most of the solar system. Fortunately, it has malfunctioned. Alright, good for it. Fuck, this thing can destroy the whole solar system. Huh, precursor, that's really great guys, don't play with them. Okay, what about this one? This rock-like material features bi biomechanical parts that match components identified in the warpers encountered on 4546B. Materials such as this may even have been a fundamental building block of the aliens' own self-repairing mechanisms. Oh, so that's how they survive for so long, for a thousand years. They can self-repair themselves. But how does this rock work? Huh, okay. What about this half moon thing? It is unclear why technology of this sophistication has not been found elsewhere on the planet. Its production may have been restricted or too costly, or it may have been uh, pillaged from a more ancient civilization. But what is this about? Some kind of a boomerang? Hmm. Fuck, there are so many things to scan and observe in this prison, I didn't expect that. This alien device appears to be designed to eliminate all organic sub substance in a range by emitting a le lethal but contained radioactive field. What? This alien device appears to be designed to eliminate all organic sub substances in a range by emitting a lethal but contained ra Okay, okay. So these things kill everybody around. Did I get that right? Fucking, there are a lot of doors everywhere that I want to observe. Okay, and there is absolutely nothing? Huh. This case contains highly sophisticated nanobots. Ah, oh, so there is something capable of infiltrating a foreign body and deconstructing it from the inside. Oh, fuck! So how do they keep them inside? <laughs> but that's really funny, I think developers were just really lazy to implement something here, like, eh, they just imagine that that's something invisible. Like a ghost. Magical ghost of Ripple of iPhone. You can see it, but it's here, believe it. Okay, what is this about? Uh, the markings on this device seem to serve no purpose beyond decoration. It may be the alien equivalent of a lamp or magnifying glass used to examine the other relics in more details. Seriously? <laughs> so why did they put this thing here? If you use it to observe all other relic stuff. Okay, cool. Uh, I think I'll first scan all these uh, relics and then I'll read this data and after that I'll try to observe of all other rooms. So what's this about? This device is a rudimentary, I don't know this word, a version of the keys used to access these facilities. It may have been kept here for symbolic purpose or legacy support. Huh, okay. Come on game, don't lock. This device is some form of communications relay, apparently projecting the presence of the user to a remote location. There do not seem to be any other devices in range. Huh, so it's Skype. Yeah, basically Skype, and I don't know, don't know why, but my game is really lagging in this prison. Here. Yeah. That looks like a gun. Really great gun. Yeah, weapon. This weapon appears to be millions of years old. Millions? And much as no previously encountered technologies. Yeah, because it's not attached to each other, but still keep itself somehow. Millions fucking years. So just... It implements that before humanity there were so ancient... Creatures. Who got really amazing and just mind-blowing blowing technologies. But where are those guys right now? So is this ghost? <laughs> this case is composed of an impregnable translucent metal at the distance end of the periodical table. Scans do not reveal any contents. Okay. 
Uh, that's fucking sore, guys. I know it. Uh, an ancient elf blade, yeah. Dated back to the 13th century Mongolian Empire. Blood samples on the blade match the DNA of seven separate heads of state from the period. <laughs> so that's Mongolian sword. Why did they get it here? It's not so cool like other stuff. Like this one million years old weapon. But still. Uh, this carving is hundreds of thousands of years old and made from an... Uh, an unrecognized natural fiber, likely grown on an as yet undiscovered planet. So what's the purpose of that? Just some kind of decoration? Okay, I think we discovered all this relic and that's fucking crazy. So I don't know why aliens was collecting something here, in this prison, why they were keeping such thing, like creating some kind of a museum in on this planet, 4546 planet, where their main purpose was to discover a cure for car disease. What the fuck is shining there? Fuck, there's so many stuff. Okay, what about this data? Uh, blah, 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 Emperor Project Data. This device records data from the primary research specimen at this facility. According to the logs, an indigenous life form referred to as the Emperor specimen was found to produce a un unique substance they referred as, uh, uh, they referred to as Enzyme 42? Yeah, Enzyme 42 is one of the ingredients to... for the cure. Uh, which inhibited the symptoms of the infection in other... Fuck, I don't know this word too. In dangerous organism. Uh, the specimen was captured and contained here. In addition to the eggs it was found guarding. Uh, the alien researchers went to great lengths to provide for the light form's environmental needs, including the... Uh, import of interdependent flora and fauna via an on-site warp gate. Huh, how, however its health quickly began to de deteriorate. Fuck, a lot of new words for me. At the time of the bacterial outbreak and resulting quarantine, all attempts to develop the enzyme into a vaccine had been unsuccessful, so how am I going to do that? Detecting increased local radiation levels. Uh -huh. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora. Oh shit! I was speaking about Aurora. Forget about that. Apparently, I'll went to creative mode for now because I'm starring a bit already. Fuck. So how? How am I be able to create a cure? I have no idea. But let's first discover what I've got here. So it looks like there will be a door that I'll have to unlock. And there is a fucking teleport, and it looks really great. <gasps> can I? I can activate that. Insert fuel crystal. How? Wait, can I get iron crystals? Iron crystal? How to spell them? One. No. Fuck. Okay, I have to look up how to spell them correct. Oh, okay. I got how does it work? Uh, item? Precursor? No, no, no. Precursor Iron Crystal 3. Yes! That's much better. So let's plug this thing. Seriously, will this teleport work? Fuck! I thought they didn't activate any teleporters in prison yet. Okay, let's see where we'll get. Oh, fuck! Oh yeah, that's a new game, that's why I've got um, this animation with teleports. But seriously, where will I appear? Hello? Hi guys, nice to meet you. Do you want to attack me? Oh shit! Wait, I know where am I? I think I know. Is this Krug's field biome? Krug's field precursor cache? So yeah, I'm pretty sure that's Cracksfield. But I barely can see something. Can I switch on the day? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby, that's Cracksfield. I really hope I pronounced that right, but anyway, let's return back and continue our amazing discovering of uh, all thing and cool stuff inside the prison. Stop. So I just realized that I've got finally my way, uh, like 
last time I was uh, discovering all these precursor caches and I was in this uh, cracks field precursor cache, I told that it would be amazing if they, if developers connect teleporters from prison to some teleporters to upper world with upper world and they did that so right now I can jump from the active lava biome to cracks field biome shit did I jump back I think I jumped back right now fuck yep I did okay let's try to do that again I really hope I feel okay after all this jumping I'm pretty sure maybe I want to throw up or something like that Ah, my poor stomach. Why? Why did you jump back? Alright, there is some lag apparently. Fuck. Come on, stop doing that. And... Just safely get out of here. No, 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 why? <laughs> it jumps back, I don't know, but it appears... Like there is angle when I appear from the teleport down there okay screw it go to prison fuck you crap see you crap all right all right game load everything where am I right here hi see dragon leviathan ah so I don't have my sea glider but I don't really need that and this door is blocked right now again why unlock doors done hey hello why it doesn't work? Unlock doors. Yes. What the fuck are you doing here, guys? You sure you can't be here? Can I kill you? Come here, buddies. No, it's too high. Okay, screw you, guys. Just keep swimming. I don't know why you're doing that with your life, but apparently you're doing. What is this? Why is this thing popping up and back all the time hmm yeah it's strange I think developers didn't finish with animation of this thing because you see it pops back really fast so this door was teleporter and this door is fucking big so maybe no actually I don't know what's there I'm pretty sure the aquarium the containment room with the sea emperor like it's right there but I don't know what's there but anyway, let's check out what we've got behind the door number two. What the fuck? Huh, apparently this room isn't finished yet. Uh, do I've got a flashlight? Can I get flashlight? At item flashlight? Oh, cool! <laughs> I didn't expect that I'll succeed so easy. So what is this place about? There are more museum thing stuff like showroom for something and one more data terminal emperor egg hatching project data hmm that's interesting thing so as far as I understood I have uh, to find a cure from care disease in the future I'll have to hatch these eggs and get this uh, enzyme from the babies and somehow in this way I'll be able to get this cure this vaccine uh, blah blah so uh, this device records all available physical data from a single point in time the last recorded data set was captured just after quarantine was imposed on the facility specimen data the main containment chamber here housed a sea emperor leviathan and its eggs the parent leviathan's health had uh, deteriorated its eggs appeared to be in good condition but in some form of a natural stasis huh Maybe because the environment is not really proper for hatching and that's why eggs got some ability to get in, in this stasis form so they'll not hatch until the environment will be proper around. Uh, alien structures. The data shows that within the vast uh, specimen containment unit an uh, incubation system had been constructed to house the Leviathan's eggs. Likely the alien researchers had refocused their efforts to develop a vaccine on the unborn infants. Uh, the incubation system suggests they had resorted to developing artificial hatching enzymes which would uh, simulate the natural hatching environment. When quarantine was imposed, all warp gates and access points to the facility were sealed. 
analysis. While the unborn emperor specimens may have held some potential for the development of a vaccine, it is highly unlikely that parents or ch children survived having their food supply cut off and being isolated from the rest of the ecosystem. But we know already that sea dragon leviathan is still alive and still exists. And it's been like thousand years already. So this creature could be really, really old. Ah, <sighs> I really want to see it, but first I want to discover and absolve all rooms. And there is one more teleport and I'm really curious what what is connected with. So let's see. Maybe it will connect to other precursor cache. I can scan this alien structure. No, I don't want to do that. And I really hope I'll not have this bag with teleport anymore. Shit, this episode so far is so cool. Did you jump back? Where am I? Hello? What the fuck? How did I get here? Okay, that's a room that I already discovered, but why I'm here? I'm pretty sure that's not right thing. Huh, and there is some hole. Okay, I'll just try to ignore all bugging stuff around and I want to check out this teleport once more. Because come on, it's teleported me somewhere, but after that it dropped me back. Heck. So, can I at least absorb... No, no, no. Coordinates. So, I'll try to see what biome I like appear in. Precursor gun? Seriously? Precursor gun? No, 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 no. You see, it dropped right back. Where am I? Okay, I'm back to this room. Fuck. Why this biome called Precursor gun? Because it's not gun at all. Maybe it's also some kind of a bug. Hmm. Okay then. Alright, I didn't succeed. This teleport always warps me back. But I have an idea how to solve this problem. So I've got this panel on the right corner. I'll try to jump right into this teleporter and write down the coordinates it shows. So let's do that. Okay, that will do. And I return back. I don't really remember the command to warp myself. Maybe actually just warp. Wait, warp and it was minus... Wait, minus... 883.9? Minus 612.1 and 1033. Hell yeah! So, where am I? What the fuck is that? Huh. So that's Lost River, but I don't remember seeing any teleports here. In the Lost River biome. Fuck. Is this a new teleporter or it was implemented long time ago and I just missed it? Yeah, it looks like a new one because all these doors is a new stuff. What the fuck was that? Okay. So, hello, hello? Oh, yeah. So, this precursor enters hidden behind the waterfall. But where am I? Oh, that's the forest. So, it's somewhere nearby the second entrance to the Lost River, the entrance that I used before. And seriously, it's so hidden. I would never try to check it out. Huh. Maybe that's exactly the entrance. The way where I entered uh, Lost River, because I remember this skull before. The skull was uh, that I was trying to scan. Fuck! Okay, I think let's return back for now, and I really hope that the teleporter will not fuck me up again. Shit, 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 no! Fuck! Okay, there is definitely some bug connected with these teleporters. Because player appeared in really strange thing and I'm stuck in a loop, yeah? Oh, no, no, no! I returned to this room, I forgot about that. Okay, 
That will do. That's great. What the? Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was my fault. So, we absorbed three rooms already on one side. And I think there are at least three rooms on the other side. And two main holes where I can go after that. Huh, and this door is blocked right now. Okay. I don't mind. I'll block it really soon. I don't even see any keyhole where I can put my uh, artifact. Heh. <laughs> Come on, game. Stay with me. What? What was this sound? Hmm. So, what's in this room? Is there one more teleporter? Yeah, it is. So, where this teleporter will lead me. And I'm pretty sure it also creates some bikes. So, I'll prepare myself for writing down the coordinates. Or maybe not. I'm just too lazy for that, so just let's hope that everything will go fine. Oh yeah, it is! So where am I right now? It's some kind of precursor cache too, but I can't really remember, where is it? Um, Again, my console is stuck, it's always showing precursor again. Maybe it is precursor again. Could it be? No! Oh, yeah, yeah, I know, where is it? It's Mushroom Forest Biome. So, it's the first cave where I discovered that I can go inside here with my Simov and I can swim here. And that's the exact place where I was so struggling with my Simov uh, trying to <laughs> get it from the ceiling. Ah, bad memory. So, let's return back to the prison. Oh, it works really fine. So, thank you at least for that. And I'm trying to remember, is there are there more precursor caches that we didn't discover the, yet, but they have uh, teleporters inside. Oh fuck. What is this? Is this some kind of a water supply system? It looks really complicated. And I know there is some kind of data that I can get and read, but I just want to observe everything on my own first. Because fuck, look at that. Can I drop down here? Will I regret my decision after that? Maybe, but I really want to do that. But wait, I'll save my game first. Wait, why did I save my game? Okay, I just remember that that's a new game and there is no point of saying that. So, can I drop down? Yes, I can. And am I stuck here? I'm pretty sure I'm stuck here right now. Fuck! Why I keep screwing my life? Huh. Okay. Maybe I load my game back. Alright, and we're back, so let's stop being dumb and doubling around with all this environment, but I'm pretty sure I can drop down there. Maybe. Hmm. But I don't see any holes or any doors or ladders, so maybe not. No, I should draw something. Okay, I'll check it out, but first thing first, I want to read this data. Alien pump. Uh, this machinery is pumping water to and from the attached pipe network. Outlaw. Oxygen depri deprived, deprived water is being flooded from the system. Uh, inflow. Analysis of the water comp position flowing in uh, indicates it is being drawn from different biomes between here and the surface of the planet. Uh, the water temperature is uh, considerably lower than the volcanic environment outside the facility and oxygen rich. And oxygen rich. So maybe that's the water that helps to provide the proper environment for Sea Emperor Leviathan and its babies. But let's drop down. Maybe I'll regret that, but I don't give a shit. I've got my save game. And yeah, there are some kind of letters that I can use. Wonderful. Maybe these letters will lead me to this third room on the left side of this uh, facility. No. Oh yeah, I'm just right here. I return back. Okay. So, I think I finished with everything and the pre show there will be something else here in the future. And frankly, all this piping system, it also looks unfinished a bit. So maybe in the future developers will implement more stuff for this room. Now, there is only one room left to discover. 
And what's there? Huh. It looks like there is nothing so far. But what will be here? I don't know, maybe one more teleporter in the future, but no, if there will be teleporter, developers would put it already here. And we could observe that. And that also looks like uh, all these memorials for precursors. Like the grapes where we can usually grab iron crystals. Okay, so there is nothing in this room so far. Later I'll try to check on the internet if there are some uh, information about this room. Like what developers are going to do about it. So, we finished with all these... I don't know, small rooms. <laughs> let's... Come on, game don't like. Let's go up to this room. And after that I'll unlock this door and we'll check see Emperor Leviathan. So, hello, hello. What's here? It looks really important too. But apparently I'm fini- Oh shit, finished! I don't know, this thing scared me. The wife on egg casing? What? What is this? Ta ta ta, the wife on egg casing. Uh, shell composition. Uh, the shell casing is formed from thick layers of carbon composite, uh, suggesting an extensive gestation period. Gestation period. Okay, uh, this Leviathan species may give birth just once per century. Oh, uh, perhaps just once in their lifetimes. And they can live for thousand years, that's the thing. Uh, shell casing incisions. Uh, precise in incisions suggest a laser-based tool was used to cut open the egg casing and to forcibly remove the fetus, fetus? inside prior to full uh, gestation. Fuck these words. <laughs> Analysis. Time pressure to develop a bacterial vaccine may have driven the alien researchers to cut open this egg and remove the fetus from for study. It is also possible that uh, removed from its parent and natural habitat, some vital condition for the infant to hatch naturally was not met. Okay, maybe that was the problem. To get this enzyme 42 ingredient you have to hatch the eggs properly and it takes a huge amount of time to do that and precursors just didn't have this time they really had to hurry up especially when carrot disease was released so that's the same egg x egg and there is absolutely nothing but it looks like a operational table i'm pretty sure that's a table where they cut the egg grab this fetus fetus thing Put it right here and make an experiment with them. And I think that's it about this room. And right now we can finally go straight to this amazing, wonderful door and unlock it. Ah, oh, shit! You can imagine. I maybe I knew about Sea Emperor Leviathan about 20, 25 episodes ago, and I was so pumped to meet it. And it took me a lot of hours of gameplay to reach this point. So, uh, unlock doors. Come on, I don't need builder. So, hi, hi, hi. Translating local alien broadcast. Warning. Vaccine development program terminated. Emperor egg hatching project terminated. Live specimens terminated. Evacuate, evacuate immediately. So, everybody is screwed. And there is one more door here. There. What's the purpose of that? Oh, fuck. Okay, I'll check it out, but first I want to visit this door. Can I see C Emperor Leviathan from this point already? What the fuck is going on there? No, I don't see him. Oh, eat. Because uh, all these Leviathan creatures, they are... Not gender stuff. It just eat. How can I climb there? For fuck's sake, seriously, how can I do that? I don't see any way to be a... to get there. But it looks really important. Hmm. Wait, can I use Freecom? So let's see what's there. Hello? Maybe absolutely nothing. Okay, so we just... the door for the sake of decoration. Okay, let's return back and... fuck, we dropped. We just dropped down. Ah. <sighs> I forgot. 
that I just shouldn't play with free cam inside the building. Okay, I return back. So, I'm back. Let's just jump into that. So, where is it? Hey! Sea Emperor! Buddy! Hi! Oh, fuck! It's fucking huge and amazing! I've never tried to spam it inside the game, I've never seen it! And I've seen only a screenshot of this creature. It's majestic! But will try to attack me or eat me or something like that. Because so far it looks really friendly. Are you friendly? Are we bro? Oh, and I can build my base right here, by the way. But I'm not sure that I need that. Fuck. Unlike other alien facilities, scans indicate this location supports a diverse and healthy ecosystem. Expl explanation unclear at this time. Huh. Why explanation unclear? You mean because there is no teleporters, they don't work anymore and uh, there was no way the water here could be healthy? Eco-friendly? Oh, peepers! Hi, peepers! Uh, detecting unusually passive behavioral patterns in nearby predators. I'm speaking about sea dragon, sea emperor leviathan. Yeah, it's really passive and really friendly. Bro, I love you and fuck, you're so majestic. And you don't even like touch me, really. I can go through you, yeah? I think so. So, okay, let's stop doubling around and discover what we've got else. For example, what is this? Iron crystals? So I have to drill them. And they look really different, so that's the chunk of iron crystal. And I know the developers implemented something like iron matrix that will be necessary to craft from iron crystals for building rocket ship to get the fuck out of this planet. So what else do we got in this in this this huge containment facility? Uh, can I get a sea glider somehow? Item C glide? Yeah, that will do. Yeah, 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 don't push your face inside this fan stuff. So, I've seen eggs somewhere. Yeah? Oh yeah, right here. So, can I interact with them somehow right now? Can I do something? Hey, hey, hey! Oh, I can scan them, of course. See, Emperor Leviathan eggs. Oh, hello? Are you doing something? Oh shit! That's really cool, this animation! So, what can I read about these X? Alien data, blah blah blah, alien structure, see Emperor Leviathan X. Number one Shell. Uncommonly strong shell lining. Organic growth on the exterior suggests these eggs may be hundreds of years old. Uh, alien tubes. Alien devices penetrate the outer shell la layer, uh, likely designed to supply them with uh, nutrients and to isolate them from the surrounding environment. Amniotic sac? Sac? Uh, unlike most other eggs where a nutrient supply is slowly exhausted by the embryo, these eggs exist in a form of a natural stasis, likely awaiting ideal hatching conditions. A uh, fatal organism. Uh, there is a high genetic match between these organisms and the Leviathan in their vicinity. Uh, they appear to be stable and healthy. It is likely that ideal hatching conditions vary considerably from ideal condition for survival of the parent. Uh, the local ecosystem appears to have prioritized the latter. Ah, uh, that's why. That's why Sea Emperor Leviathan is dying slowly. Fuck, it's sad. So, can I scan something else? Ah, in incubator device, okay? Are you going to sit down again? Hey, where are you? Because seriously, that looks really great. Oh shit.
Seriously, this looks really cool. And so, I guess each time I go to this location, it's just going to sit down. And I've seen some kind of a screenshots, maybe. I'm not sure, but as far as I understood, see Emperor Leviathan will try to communicate with you. And tell you something, and maybe even help you to solve this problem with uh, Cara disease. <sighs> okay. Let's read about C... no, no, incubator device. Uh, this alien device is some form of incubator attached intravenously to the Leviathan's eggs, allowing nutrients to be fed in. Okay, bro. Your eggs are safe. I'll take care of them. I promise. So, what else we can observe here? Oh, there is teleport right here. So maybe that's exact teleporter that was used to bring all food here. And I'm out of iron crystals. Fuck. Item, precursor, ion crystal? Wait, crystal one. Done. And what's behind the teleporter? Oh shit, don't scare me like that. So, way it goes. And I'm recording already for more than uh, one hour. I didn't expect that this episode would be so long. But I'm just so pumped about everything. What the heck? Wait a minute. That's gun. That's gun island. Just right inside this moon pool for Cyclops. And I don't remember any teleporter here, detecting massive energy signature in the region. Yeah, that's the gun. So I can teleport myself straight to the gun. I can build my base right here on the island. Huh. That's so cool. Okay, let's return back and see what else we can find uh, inside containment room. What can I scan? Hmm. Aquarium warp gate. Warp gate. Okay. Uh, scans indicate this warp gate has not been activated since the facility was abandoned. It likely serves served as an access point to the surface of the planet. It is much too small for the Emperor's specimen to pass through, but may accommodate uh, a javelin specimen. Huh. I'm speaking about precursor. Uh, why are you let down like that? Are you okay? Seriously, is it right? What's wrong with you? Why you don't move? Wait a minute, have you died? What the fuck? Oh. Seriously, I think it's dead. And I miss this animation, but I really doubt that there are some kind of a great anima animation right now. Especially considering the point that there is uh, this mountain, but... Could it be really dead? Because I'm pretty sure it will work like that in the future. See, Emperor Leviathan will try to communicate with you and will try to help you, you, but... And will ask you to take care of eggs, but after that, it... will die. And that's it, you will have to take care of eggs. You'll have to hatch them. You'll have to get enzyme from them. Maybe. And... To create a cure. Vaccine against Caro disease. Fuck, that, that's sad. That's really sad. I wasn't expecting that I would be sad about such big scary creature dying in the Subnautica game. And frankly, I don't see anything else that what I can observe here. There is some kind of a caves. Hmm. Hmm, what the heck? Uh, the buried plant life in this area is growing outside its normal biome conditions. The presence of the other life forms fertilizing and pruning the vegetation may be upsetting this environmental deficit. What the heck? I barely understood what I was reading. But something about environment. Hmm. That's really low. Could it be the lowest point in the Subnautica game? 1616. Can I find some other caves that's much lower? Here in this containment room. 
Because I just, I'm not sure that I can go... No, I can't go deeper. The deepest point in the active lava biome is my base, where I located my base. You can't go deeper, because there are lava lake. And this is the only place where you can go deeper. Because uh, as far as I understood, the lava lake is located upper, right there. And I don't see any other caves, so I think, yeah, that was the deepest point in Subnautica game. 1600... 16 meters. Oh, no, you can go deeper. 1621, 1622, hi crap, fuck you crap. Oh! You can go even much deeper, what the heck is this cave right now? Fuck! 1650... I don't know, 5, 4? What's the purpose of this cave? Was this cave built by precursors? Or it was created naturally? And I lost myself, I don't know the way out. Oh, okay. So we're right here. Fuck, that was really amazing episode. I discovered so much stuff and so far that's the most interesting facility in the whole Subnautica world. And we're really close to the end of this game, really close. The next thing that we have to do, we'll have to do, is to deal with these eggs and hatch them. And I'm really pumped about... Wait, I can use it? Hatching enzyme, creep point sample. Scanner room speed upgrade. What is this? Wait, hatching enzyme, I can get it? What the heck? How does it work? So? Hmm, I can't use it anymore. Oh! scared me <laughs> oh shit so they all wa were hatched but there is no babies so far so babies were not implemented and I'm pretty sure the Emperor Leviathan would not die like that it would not uh, hide all these eggs oh shit this catching sound really scared me are you baby wait a minute what the fuck is that so that's a babies! Okay, guys, chill for a moment. Where are you? And for fuck's sake, they've got this ability... Come here. They've got this ability to go through the ground, so it will be really hard to catch them. Fuck, stop! Stop moving! Why are you so fast? Okay, babies is really complicated and hard. Fuck. You piece of shit, why you die right now, huh? Why I have to deal with your babies? Come here. How I can grab them? Come on, come on, come on. Fuck, they look really strange. Like real embryon. Really small one. Wait, what I can scan else? I've just seen something scannable right now. Can I scan, by the way, Sea Emperor? Or can I scan this douchebag who is swimming away from me? Alright, I can scan C Ember Leviathan. And I think that's it. I discovered everything in primary containment facility. I don't really know what to do with these small douchebags. But that's okay. Maybe I'll just wait uh, till the moment when there will be more updates added to this game connected with primary containment facility. And I'll try to visit it once more. And for now, that's it guys. Ah, smash the like button if you enjoyed this episode. And don't forget to enjoy your life. Fuck, it's already half past midnight. I have to go sleep. So, see you guys.